On the ninth day of Vlogmas, this is what we did. Opened a package, ragged on Travis Scott. Watched, observe, played Warzone. Was a psychic. Sniffed a shirt, laughed a little bit, ate Subway, and rubbed my camera lens. Hey vlog, it's Vlogmas Day 9, I think? Or 8. It's either 8 or 9, but I am just about to play Warzone. I haven't vlogged all day. Um, I'm honestly just getting burnt out. Like, I feel like I have so much stuff to do and I can't get anything done because I'm working or taking a break from work. So, it's been, um, pretty crazy. But, I have, like, two vlogs to edit. Um, I'm still filming every day because, <laughs> I don't know. I think it's fun, but... It's definitely hard when you have a regular job like me. <laughs> and not like all these other YouTubers who get who only do this for the for the um for a living. But um I wanted to tell you guys what happened today. So I was supposed to get off at 11 today, 11 a.m. for my first session and have it be a short session, but um, they ended up switching the plans and it turned out better because then we weren't missing any hours and I actually got like an extra hour technically because I went to them, went with them to the hospital and then, you know, got, uh, we got done with that and then we went to their house and finished session there so we did that um and I got off at the same time that I usually do and then I went to my second oh I went to Subway actually and and I ate a meatball sub this time and I don't know I just wanted to eat right away so I didn't vlog <laughs> and I was also watching this um interview with um, what's his name? Um, oh, Travis Scott. And, um, this guy, it's a, he's a YouTuber and his channel is called Observe and he, um, reads nonverbal communication. So he was reading Travis Scott's nonverbal communication as he was, um, in the interview and it was not good. <laughs> uh, Travis Scott is like, not accepting responsibility basically and he just basically said that he was going to do the same thing in the future um but he's still trying to figure out why this happened and what the solution is and um <laughs> it's like why do you not know what happened and he thinks that he did everything that he could have done in the situation which I don't think that's true, and according to Observe, which, you know, he can't for sure say that he's lying, but he says that he does believe that Travis Scott was lying um, when he says that he did everything that he could have done, so... If you're not caught up on that, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just went on a tangent, but it's just this rapper who had a concert and it turned into a mass casualty um, event and 10 people died or 8 people died, something like that. And um, like 300 were injured and it was like too crowded and nobody did anything about it basically. I mean, like, yeah, like, the ambulance tried to come, and, like, there was a lot of people on the scene, but, um, it just was really bad, uh, and way too crowded for what the arena should have been. So, um, yeah, it was a really bad thing that happened, and Travis Scott basically didn't do really anything about it in the moment, 
Um, and he just continued with his concert. Like, nothing was happening. So, yeah. <laughs> that's why everybody's mad at him. And that's why there's, like, a bunch of talk around it. But, um, yeah, I was too busy doing that during lunch. <laughs> and I only had, like, a little bit of time for lunch. Because um, I had to, like, drive to my early session. But in my second session, my client ended up actually falling asleep. So we ended up cutting the session short. Um, and I got to come home earlier and we ate some pasta for dinner. And now we're going to play some Warzone, even though I have so much stuff to do. Um, but I decided to vlog um, before we started playing so that I can have at least one clip for today. <laughs> Hopefully more, but we'll see. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. I'll see you hopefully after this. <laughs> hey guys, I'm back. So, um, I wanted to tell you guys that something funny happened just now. So I was, um, editing my vlog from, I think two days ago. And, um, I, uh, needed to write down the Vlogmas intro that I do because in every intro of Vlogmas I do, like, the number of things for the day of Vlogmas. So, today, I, or that day, it was Vlogmas Day 7, so I needed seven things, and I sing my intro so I have to like sing seven things and um, so, so I forget. So I have to write them down. And I said this in last year in the last year's vlogs. Um, but I like just needed a piece of paper. So I went in my drawer and I like pulled out this notebook. And you know, sometimes I get like, like I have like this. Oh, I showed you this in that vlog actually. It's like um, like a little notepad that I put lists on and stuff. So sometimes I get that, but today I just grabbed this like notebook, right? And it has the Vlogmas um, intro stuff on it from last year. <laughs> so it's like so funny that I grabbed it and I was like, oh my gosh, like it literally, like I pulled it on that day. So that was pretty cool. I was like, oh, fate, it's meant to be. <laughs> but I also wanted to show you that I got a um, package in the mail and it's from fanjoy so that means um it's from youtube merch <laughs> um so i follow this uh youtuber named colleen ballinger and i am really invested in her journey of like being a mom and stuff and she just had twins so um she just brought one of her twins home home because uh they were in the NICU for a while I'm just gonna set you guys down right here so they were in the NICU uh for a while so um she just got to bring the last baby home and so that's really nice but the reason I'm bringing her up is because this is her merch and I really wanted it because of what it says on it and I'll show you when I open it um, it's just perfect for me. Oh my gosh, this package is so hard to open. What the heck? I might need scissors. Oh, I guess I'll just get scissors. Um, but I also wanted to say something else. Oh, so it's actually with this, this shirt, it's a shirt. Um, that I bought um, they sent me an email back like when I bought it and I didn't see the email for a couple days because um, it was in spam for some reason it was in my spam folder so I finally see it and they're like hey um, we actually ran out of the medium so would you like a small or a large instead so I was like oh, I guess I'll do a large you know so I email them back and then they, they email me again. They're like, hey, sorry, we actually sold all the larges too. So they were like, you can get an extra large or a small. So I was like, oh, well, I don't want it to not fit. So I ended up just getting an extra large. So we'll see how big it is. 
but I was like, well, I guess we'll just wear it like a night shirt. <laughs> um, hopefully it's soft. Looking at it, actually, it looks like a little thick, which is interesting. Wow. Okay, so here's what the shirt says. It says, I cry a lot. Because <laughs> I really do cry a lot. I probably don't cry as much as um, uh, Colleen does, but I do cry a lot. Okay, so this is how big the large is. I know you can't see the bottom half of me, but um, it's kind of like a shirt dress. So it is, it is long. It's an extra large. So I expected that, but I was just hoping that it would be kind of small <laughs> for some reason. I could probably still wear it as a regular shirt, but I just like have to tie it or something and like roll these sleeves up. But yeah, this is the shirt that I got. I'm so excited to wash it and wear it because it smells kind of interesting. It smells like... Oh, it smells like ink, like permanent marker. And I'm assuming that's because this is what it smells like. Because it's like dye. I don't know. But it smells like something, so I need to wash it. But I am so excited to wear it. Okay, well, it's really late, so I'm going to go to bed. But thank you guys for watching this vlog. I hope you have a great day day, evening, whenever you're watching this. And I really hope to get these vlogs up soon before Christmas. Because I already know I'm going to be really busy on Christmas. So hopefully tomorrow I can edit more. Um, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.